We found diamonds, we found diamonds, we found diamonds before episode three. And that's my diamond song. So now I'll see you guys in the next episode. Hey everyone, what's going on? It is Cedric Blitz or Justin, and welcome back to some more United UHC season four, episode number three. And where last episode, we found a really good cave system, which I'm hoping will lead us to a couple of kills, um, if not just one kill. So um, let's quickly ditch the things we definitely do not need. All that nonsense is very much unneeded. Uh, lapis don't need, emeralds, I don't expect to find a village farm, which I probably will not uh, throw it out. And uh, let's make ourselves a chest plate, obviously. That's the best, best way to go about it. And please let us get prot one we massively need prot one right here then we can get prot two come on let's be on my side let's go <sighs> that is depressing oh aa12 was slain by shut up brick the first actual pvp engagement in the server going down that's a gg2 brick the very first death happening that's not related to pve oh man Things are getting spicy. Oh, that scared the crap out of me again. Um, I'm gonna finally get down into this ravine, see where it can take me. Maybe leave me some more diamonds. Um, I'm really disappointed that I did not get Pra one off that chest plate. I felt like it was the right thing to risk the enchantment instead of just instantly putting the book on it. Because, I mean, the risk was all about getting Pra 2, uh, which we obviously did not get. What is happening? Everyone's moving around, leaving, going everywhere. Oh, jeez. Going practice. Hello? Oh my goodness, everyone is just doing weird things. It's so scary. The thing is, that's gonna happen one of these times. I'm gonna assume it's just like a mishap, a mess up, and then it's gonna be legitimately someone talking next to me who gets quiet because they hear me, and I'm just gonna keep on talking, assuming it was like some weird glitch or mess up again, and I'm gonna die because of that. So if I do die, I'm gonna blame Billy. Isaac goes down to Zyper. So much fighting is happening in this episode. Man, where is Harvey? I want to get this fight going now. I am like thirsty for blood, even though like I'm, 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 I'm relatively stacked. I should really go for a quick sharp three iron sword. I mean, we're in this giant ravine, tons and tons of redstone for some easy levels. Um, it should be smart to do. And I'm, I'm gonna check this area out real fast. Hello, water, please. I didn't pick you up apparently. First things first, we're making all the gapples we can, and then let's start getting a few more iron swords. Uh, if we get really lucky, we should be able to do it with relative ease. Sharp one, okay, one more. Sharp one, yes, perfect, okay. Now we need to anvil these together, and then we need, I believe, nine levels, seven levels. So we need two more levels to grab up the sharp three. Gonna be huge, obviously, with that fighting already happening. You know there's gonna be a lot more happening in this episode. Um, unless players get really, really strategical and start kind of camping when they hear players um, and getting really quiet, which is honestly what I'm assuming everyone's doing. Um, I really want to know if those people who've already fought, if they, like, hurt each other and just talk to each other oh my that's a lot of gold right there i'm going for that because i feel like i kind of want to do that or again go with the whole trolling thing all right there we go seven levels of sharpness oh right it does cost nine levels i'm in 1.8 that's my bad guys i'm sure a lot of you are yelling me about that always an issue that i have when playing united uhc's because i always play in 1.8 as i'm just used to that and the xp levels are vastly different which is why i was confused i assumed it was going to cost nine levels like it does i'm pretty sure I saw seven and just went for it, so uh, it's my bad. Luckily, there's tons of emeralds around here, so that's a lot of really quick levels. Uh, so I'm going to do that. There we go. There's the sharp three iron sword. I really shouldn't say those things out loud, because someone could literally be stalking me right now, just listening to everything that I have. I mean, honestly, I've gotten no diamonds besides enough to enchant, and I'm not looking too good. So if anyone's near me, please just let, let you know. Let me know. I can't talk. It's hard. And Ginger goes down to Nikolai. That is a GG right there. My goodness, so much fighting is happening in the first 10 minutes of this episode. I know I'm going to fight someone. I just do not know who. I'm hoping. I don't really know, to be honest. I'm just finding the best caves. How are there no diamonds right now? This is ridiculous. And also, how am I not finding other players? I'm finding these huge, ginormous caves where other players have to have seen before. But I guess not, because, I mean, all the stuff is here. And there's no way they would leave diamonds behind. 
you know what? I take it back. My biggest question is, how have I not found any mobs whatsoever? Like, is it that hard to ask for a skeleton or two? Maybe some spiders? Uh, I could really use a bow or a rod. Can some chickens be down here to lay some eggs for me? Like, <laughs> let me get something. Thank you. Thank you, Cave, for finally supplying me with what I need. Now it's time to decide, uh, am I going to make legs or am I going to wait for possibly two more pieces of diamond to get boots and a helmet? I feel like that's the better move. At this point, if I hear someone again, I should probably... If I hear someone again, I'm probably going to just quickly, uh, uh, sporadically make... The, the pants just to do it because i mean i'd rather have some form of diamond armor on me instead of uh, have the ability to make it but not actually do it but yeah if i actually i'm just, I'm just gonna wait up until that point so if i don't hear anyone and i do get a few more diamonds uh, i'm gonna make the smart choice but if i hear someone uh, then i'm gonna make the dumb but logical choice and hopefully it works out for me Can anyone hear me friends I mean you no harm, I swear. I'm a pacifist in this UHC. One more. Please be one more. <sighs> it's been a good game so far, my fr Oh, ooh, okay. Okay, I see you. I see you. Let's make sure we're as safe as we possibly can be. We do that. Perfect. There we go. Let's get around the other side again. Make sure. Boom, like so. We actually are missing... Uh, one area. It's gonna be a bit risky to get the block next. Ooh, maybe this one too. Ooh! Okay, we're good. Let's uh I don't wanna do this. Let's just do that. There we go. A perfect, okay. Easy way to do it. Now we are looking really, really good. Give me that please. The smart choice it is. I am super happy about that. And now hopefully don't want to change a feather. Please. Really? I can be that lucky, but I really can't be that lucky. I could put the prop book on the helmet, but I mean, what if I do find more diamonds and get enough for legs? Then I might as well wait to see if those get prop one and then make those prop two. Uh, there's so many options. At this point, I should just uh, make another chest plate. Skeppy, no! Skeppy dies to Zyper! <sighs> Rip the dream. Zyper is kind of killing it in this game. Um, so I'm, I'm a bit afraid. I'm a bit afraid. Already down to 17 players. That's a lot of players that have died. Five, if you want to do math uh, properly. But right now, I'm just thinking uh, I could put the prop book I have on the helmet. That would kind of make sense, but I'm getting relatively lucky, so I could just wait if I find enough diamonds to get either another chest plate or some pants. Then it might be worth to save the book until I can enchant that to see what I get out of that. There's a lot of choices right now. I think I'm just going to, again... Stay kind of smart with it, see what we can do, and just hold out as long as we can. If I end up losing because of it, I mean, I really don't know. I'm sure if I lost, some people would say, well, if you put Prada on that helmet, you would have won the fight. And depending on how low the other player gets, if I do end up dying, may be the case. But I'd rather try my hardest to play smart than get scared and play stupid, if that makes any sense to you guys. Zyper again with all of the kills. What is happening? How is he finding so many players so quickly? This is ridiculous. I'm literally going to die next episode, I swear. But guys, if you have enjoyed, drop a like, subscribe, subscribe, and all that jazz. Check out the perspectives linked down below. Make sure you guys tune in in two days from now. Every other day as these episodes are uploaded for episode number four of United UHC. And yeah, other than that, I will talk to you all later. Have a nice day, guys. Thank you all so much for watching. Peace out. How you feel about me I don't even know how I feel about you I've been off and off for the past few weeks I don't got a clue how you can